is what is uh, smoky here. Today is the anniversary, well technically it will be tomorrow, but today is the anniversary of what place owns. Today I thought we'd go over my final Nintendo product, so let's get into this. Okay, so today we are going to go over my Nintendo GameCube. Yo guys, um, something that was not planned just happened. The lamp just quit working, the light itself, so I don't know what's wrong with it, so I gotta shut off just in case, so I don't cause a fire. And it's a mess to go get all the cords and see if it's plugged in properly, or what's going on with it. So, we're just gonna get straight into the gameplay, that's why there's no overshot of the GameCube. But, yeah, so... But Let's get into this. Enemy, to Today is the last time I will be in this setup because I am moving to a desk that's out in my living room where you hear all the noise from right now just for more room to do stuff because the stressor is getting crowded. So I thought I would do a gaming one. Um, you don't have to pardon me for the mess because I was getting stuff ready for the next episode which I'm going to move the next episode to stuff. So hopefully you didn't see what it was. And if you got a glimpse of it, you know what the next episode was. Um, or is. I've just been kind of writing episodes and try to figure out what I'm doing for next week. I'm doing two episodes this week in honor of the anniversary. One comes out tomorrow. They're back to back. Um, so, yeah. <clears throat> the GameCube was originally released on September 14th, 2001. I think that's when it was released in America. I didn't really read it. I just looked for when it was really released. Which, by most people, was not Nintendo's best console. But personally, I still like it. Um, that's my opinion. It was different than previous consoles because it actually had a disc instead of a cartridge. And you can still play, I think, as Game Boy Advance games on it. I'm not 100% sure. It might have been original. I don't remember. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. I didn't. I forgot to look that part up. I was just trying to get this episode done. Um, consoles is that I had So now that I've explained a little bit, let's look at the console and play a couple of games. It's completely dark in here right now. Um, I'm turning on the GameCube so I can get the footage. But yeah, the light just went out, like I said. Um, I went to take the light thing off, which it's not. It's the thing's broke, so you gotta be careful taking it down. Apparently, I wasn't careful enough. Um, I didn't want to play the game. I wanted to go to the main menu. Um, we said it, and it'll work. Okay, I may have to take the game out to... Yeah, I won't have to take the game out, so I'll be... This is what I wanted to show you. The actual menu before we get into the game. Now, I actually have a memory card for this. Now, here's a simple menu. I don't know if this will work or... Okay, we went to options, we got sound. Let's see. I don't know how I can I don't know if I can change it but there's sound there's screen position there's the calendar which it is only off by a day in a year I don't know about the time so the purpose of Quartz Bazaar is to make the best videos we can and to make science more approachable. Thank you so much for making this possible. Okay, yeah, it's only off by a year and a day. I don't know about the time, but we're going to confirm it. Then we push finish. I'll go back there and get the time. And then you can see what's on your memory card, which I only have one memory card for this. We got some Tony Hawk. Customs. Um, we got some Star Fox Assault on here. We got some Paper Mario. We got Tony Hawk Underground saves. Um, and then uh, Super Smash Bros. Melee. Which there will be Super Smash Bros. Melee footage. But that won't be until tomorrow because Timothy is asleep right now as I'm recording this. So if you see him in the background, that's why he's laying down. Um, but yeah. So now let's get into the game. 
I'll see you guys in a second. Yo guys, um, something that was not planned just happened. The lamp just quit working, the light itself. So I don't know what's wrong with it, so I gotta shut off just in case. So I don't cause a fire. And it's a mess to go get all the cords and see if it's plugged in properly. Or what's going on with it. So, we're just gonna get straight into the gameplay. That's why there's no overshot of the GameCube. But, yeah, so. Let's get into this. And now, I don't know if this will be on mine or Xavier's, so I'm going to try to attempt to load mine. If I can get to work right. Now, these controllers are original GameCube controllers that I'm actually using. So, the joysticks on them are wore out. Um, so, I have to use the D-pad now. If you guys would like to see what my guy looks like. We got this GameCube, I forgot to mention at the beginning. A couple years ago, Dad got it when he still worked at Piedmont, which is an apartment complex, and somebody left it. So, Dad took it. I don't even know. Ah, Road Park. Let's see if I have any parks still in here. I know I made a couple. CK. Yeah, let's play CK. Uh, but yeah, there should be Super Smash Bros. Um, stuff tomorrow in this video and then I'm going to film the uh, next video also tomorrow see if I can still pull this off I don't even remember now, this is a Tony Hawk game just in case if you were wondering um, this is underground I think I'll have to I can't even grind with that It's weird. It feels weird using the knee pad. It feels old school. <laughs> what button was it that I did tricks with? There we go. I can kind of do some tricks. You can set your own personal tricks on here. Uh, I don't remember what my personal was. My personal best, but... Yeah, this is something different. The graphics have definitely changed since this game came out in 2001. Well, since this console came out in 2001, I don't know when this game came out, but the graphics have changed since then too. Back in the days when you know, the game just kind of looked different. Kind of almost looks like Saints Row 1 graphics. If you really think about it. Since Rogue One didn't look too terribly bad, in my opinion. Um, but, yeah, so, there's some gameplay lists. Now, I would do missions, but I suck at trying to do all the other tricks, so I don't play it as often. Guys, that's gonna be it until tomorrow, so peace. Also, I want, but as you can see, the GameCube kind of runs decently for its time period. Um, the games ain't doing too terribly bad, they ain't lagging. Like some modern single player games are still lagging, they don't run right. <clears throat> and believe it or not, I actually had Red Dead Redemption 2 lagging on my Xbox the other day. I was fishing and it just froze as like, what the heck, and then it came out a couple seconds later, and the fish broke my line, I was super angry. So, yeah, that's it for now, guys. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow with Smash Bros. footage. I'm going to go ahead and see this, and I'll see you after this. Okay, we got light. We're going to play Smash Bros. Best games on the system, um, so, just for fun. <laughs> I thought you were good, Timmy. I am. This is how I've played this in a long time. How come? You're at 57, I'm only at 46. Dude, 
Dude, I'm winning. Now. Yeah, I'm winning. Well, now you're winning. Not much. Yeah. The hundreds. It's good. No, it's over. It's the least amount of damage. That's how we always used to play. <laughs> I cheat. How would that be cheating? Dude, Mewtwo okay. is like the biggest cheater. Yeah. Okay, so now we played some of this. Yeah. What are your thoughts? Uh, this sucks, this controller. Not talk about the controllers because the controllers are old AF. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> but so, what do you think of the? Do you like the GameCube besides the yeah, junky controllers? Of course I do. But the controllers are the only thing I'm having problems with. Me too. Other than that, the system still works and I like it. So yeah, let's come to the conclusion of this. Episode. Play a full match. I just wanted to get enough in to get this video done because of all the problems I have while filming this one. Um, so that's it for this episode of what Chris owns like. Comment, subscribe, share, turn on post notifications. Go follow me on Instagram at SmokyVersusYT. Go follow me on Twitter at SmokyVersusYT. See you guys in the next video. Peace.